here's an excellent lesson that's going to really drive home a point. I want you to take a look again at the query and you know the table and the credits is four. Tell me what the answer is going to be here. But don't worry so much about the answer. I want you to tell me what the column heading is going to say when this query runs because I've got no alias after that end statement. This is the heading that it produced, case expression. Sometimes it's even got part of the case expression there. That's probably not what you want. Now, I'm not here to tell you that every case statement has to have an alias after it because there's a couple situations like if you put it in your order by statement that you wouldn't actually want it, it would error. But 99% of the time when you have a case statement, make sure after the end that you give it an alias for the column heading on the report. Once again, notice my else statement here and the don't know with the apostrophe. Let's just break that down to why this works. We say else, single quote, don't know, single quote. But the system would get confused if it saw just a single apostrophe here because now there would be three single quotes. So it's called an escape character. We want don't know and we want the apostrophe. So we have to say single quote, single quote, single quote. And they go, oh, that's not really the end of the literal. It's a single quote. So when it sees the one at the end, it says it's don't apostrophe no. This lesson brought to you by Coughing Data Warehousing. Need to learn SQL for Nitiza, Teradata, or Aster? Visit coughingdw.com for our helpful training guides. With Teratom, SQL stands for So Quickly Learned. Hi, this is Tom Coughing. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please hit subscribe to make sure you are kept up to date on all our videos.